Don't click off. Don't click off. Use your free will and override it. <laughs> I'm going to mute you. There we go. <laughs> Dana, tell that thing to step forward. What's your name in the name of Jesus? What's your name, I said? I'm not playing with you. Father, release fire on this thing. Serpent, come up in the name of Jesus. Come up in the name of Jesus. Speak. What's your name in the name of Jesus? I am talking not to Dana, but the spirit influencing her right now in the name of Jesus. Where'd the box go? I can't find her. Out in the name of mighty Jesus. Speak. Come out of Dana's throat right now in the name of Jesus. I cast you out. Come in agreement with me, Dana. You can breathe, right? Give me a thumbs up. Okay. Out in the name of mighty Jesus, you cursed demon. Let her speak in the name of Jesus. Out of her mouth. Out of her mouth. In the name of Jesus. Out of her mouth. Out of her throat. Dana, I want you to say your name in the name of Jesus. <laughs> Tap on the microphone on your phone. I want to see if your equipment's working. It's working. In the name of Jesus, speak. Let her go. Come out, serpent. <laughs> there you go. You're going to roast. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. You're going to fry. How do you feel about going to the pit? <laughs> yeah, you know what? You've lost her. She belongs to Jesus. And you know what Satan's going to do to you? You know what he's going to do to you. When you get down in the abyss, you get down in the pit, he's going to torture you. He's going to torment you. That's why you're getting scared and getting fearful because Jesus defeated you. You're cursed into everlasting fire. Jesus's words, you think they're a lie? Exactly who he is. He said, depart from me. You cursed into everlasting fire reserved for the devil and his angels. Yeah. Yeah. That's why you're doing it. You're listening to every word. You think you're so cool divination and Jezebel that's why you exposed yourself right now because you know you are absolutely defeated you know what he's going to do to you you're cursed into everlasting fire so you're ready for some company father in the name of Jesus Jesus would you send angelic warriors I'm talking nine foot ten foot warrior angels with flaming swords in the name of Jesus yeah you're gonna like them and begin to torment the demons in this precious lady. Dana, I know that you, you can hear me. So in your mind, you are renouncing every sin, every occultic sin, demonic sin, sex with that guy who was in the occult. You rebuke it. That's all right. Keep laughing. All witchcraft curses in the name of mighty Jesus. Divination come up <laughs> in the name of mighty Jesus. You're going to hell. And, and I would laugh too, because I think it's awesome where you're going to be burned. You're going to be floating in the lake of fire. And you know what? Me and Dana are going to sit there in lawn chairs on the side, eating boiled peanuts and watching you just gargling and drowning in the lake of fire. Satan's going to be right in there with you. And we're going to be watching it. Yeah, so all that fear and anxiety, multiply in the name of Jesus sevenfold. Yeah, you're going to be gargling fire, evil, evil. <laughs> What's your name in the name of Jesus? Say it now. When I ask you, you have to obey in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, fire upon you in the name of Jesus. More, please, Lord. More, please, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, fire upon you. You're under throne room conviction. Keep throwing up, Bimnet. That's good, sweetie. Others are, see, look at you. <laughs> scared. See, you're weak. Sandra, you're all right, sweetie. You can breathe. 
You're weak in the name of Jesus. Kelly, this is where we want you. This is where we wanted the lady the other day who left. Esther, this is where we want you. Marina, this is where we want you. Full-on deliverance. We curse you right now. We release more fire all over you. The demon operating in, near, or around Dana. Release her now in the name of Jesus. Oh, yeah. You got to laugh to keep from crying, don't you? Release her now. In the name of Jesus, we bind you according to Matthew 18, 18. Everybody's right hand towards Dana. And I want you speaking deliverance. I want you cursing this thing in the name of Jesus and commanding it to dry up and to wither up. You have lost your legal rights. So anything you've remembered from doing deliverance or being here or wherever you learn deliverance, do it now. Direct it towards the thing. She's re we went through a lot of that stuff, Christian, but uh, I mean, she can renounce it again. Yeah, that's, that's good. So keep renouncing the, the fornication, uh, the sin with the guy who worships Satan and all of that. Come out of agreement with it. Every tattoo, every demonic occultic thing, every drug use, in the name of Jesus, I know you have, uh, but I want to uh, I want to make sure we keep going through it. All witchcraft curses over you, intimidation or control, anything trying to manipulate you, come out in the name of mighty Jesus. All right, Dana, you there? Yeah. <clears throat> you remember when it overtook you? Were you conscious? Sometimes people are, sometimes you're not. Mm -hmm. What does that mean? No. Oh, wow. You don't remember what just happened? No. I think strong. Do you hear a name? Holy Spirit. I'm, I'm sure you are. Well, basically, do you want to know what happened? Oh, my paper's wet. Yeah, I imagine you were drooling on it, and I was going to get you to wipe your face. I should have been more respectful. Yeah, but you were drooling pretty bad. Do you have a name in in the name of Jesus, Holy Spirit, release to Dana now. So Jezebel, Python, witchcraft, speak to her, demon, in the name of Jesus. In the Holy Ghost conviction, you must release. All right, Dana, let's switch gears. Can you tell if something came out of you and exited you? Yeah, what? Can you tell if something exited you? That's probably not correct English, but left you. I, I feel like it's still there like a little bit. It's got my mind kind of like wandering. Okay. Well, basically you manifested and that thing overtook your face and was making faces and laughing and all kinds of stuff. That's good. It's not bad. It's good because it shows it's scared. It's losing its stronghold. It's losing its power. Demon's not going to reveal itself when... If it doesn't have to. Anything else you can share with us right now, Dana? Mm -hmm. What does that mean? No. Okay. That's Ohio talk. Yeah, we do that in the South too. Bimnet, how you doing? You throw some demons up, girl? Come on, talk to me. All right, Bimnet's running incognito. That's all right. Sandra, how we doing, buddy? I'm so manifesting. One more time. I'm so manifesting. Yeah, I see. I see you in pain. No. You can breathe. Yes, thank you. Everybody's right hand towards Sandra. Enemy, we are tired of it now. Manifestations go in the name of Jesus. Come on up, Bimnet. Come on, let's go, Bimnet. Come on, let's go in the name of Jesus. We bind up every demon attacking Sandra. Come on, Bimnet, let's go. I know it's angry. Bimnet says manifesting a lot. I can feel it's angry. Well, I hate it. I'm angry too. I'm angry that it's torturing you. Bring it up here and let's give it the proper torment it needs. It's okay. Jesus is with you. Dana just went up there. That's how you get free, y'all. Just stepping up, just like Dana did. Her belief is changing. 
She's coming to Jesus. She's releasing. She's less worried. She's on camera. The thing's recording. And she ain't worried about it. She ain't going to get free. Ain't you, Dana? You're determined, aren't you? Yeah, you remind me of Sandra. She write everything down and ask questions. And that's good. That's how you get free. Less talking, more listening, more doing. Come on, Bimnet, let's go. Lord, please bring back Sister Cameron for testimony. Any demon sitting there on the edge of somebody, Abigail, Marina, I think Kelly's busy, I can't tell. Kelly, you busy? I can't hear you. Yeah, baby's awake, but she's fine. Well, I didn't want to, uh, yeah, get you if you're too distracted. In the name of Jesus, Brittany, the thing holding her down at night, feeling her up, out in the name of Jesus, manifest and come out of Brittany and Kelly. Right now in the name of Jesus, Patricia, Melissa, Johnny, Bimnet, get the courage. Override your feelings and do it, Bimnet, and do it. Turn on the camera. Turn on the camera. Let's go. If Abigail can do it. You can do it. Abigail hates the camera, but she turned it on. Out in the name of Jesus. Rosa says, come out. Come out of my friend, Bimnet. Dana's demon, you're going to burn. You're going to die. Dana has to do one thing, and let's keep coming back. Keep believing. Yeah, we're going to torment you. Out of Abigail now. Nothing better be touching her. Nothing better be touching her. In the name of Jesus, out of Brittany now, out of Byron, out of Sister Kelly, all demonic entities out. In I'm going to make a project out of you. Uh. <laughs> You know what's going to happen to you, right? You ever heard the theme song from The Exorcist? I think I'm going to start playing it for you. Yeah. Jesus is going to carve you out of her like warm butter. Yeah. You're going to burn. You know what the pit's like? You've never been there, I can tell. It's abject loneliness like you've never even imagined see you're a spirit you're real most people don't know that but you're gonna feel <laughs> yeah you think it's funny you just wait because we're gonna be laughing yeah you're a wicked little rascal yeah <laughs> you don't know a lot yet about jesus but you're gonna learn you're gonna learn the hard way aren't you You're going to be tortured, and it's going to go on for eternity. You need to be scared because your day with her is over. That's why you're manifested. Yeah, she loves Jesus now. She's not going to hell with you. I probably shouldn't be talking so much with you, but I want you to be an educated demon. I want you to understand the process that's happening to you as it's happening. I want you to understand that it's being done in the name of Jesus. Mm, it's going to be delicious. It's going to be delicious. I'm going to let you think about that. <laughs> Woo! Somebody say, come on. I love to see Jesus' power at work. Keep coming out of Bimnet, out of Kelly, in the name of Jesus. Kelly, we need to release it. Let it go in Jesus' name. Let it go. I belong to Jesus. You have no rights. You have no power over me. Saying it out loud, Bimnet and Kelly, nobody can hear you. Let go. Pride, reservations, hesitations, worrying about people's opinions. 
Tell them to get out, the spirits. They want to keep you in bondage. All the things that you're strapped to that are bad in your life, they want to keep you strapped to it. Get rid of them. If you think it and you desire it at this stage, it's probably in your flesh. You want to walk by spirit, not by flesh. That's why it's a battle before you think about going to a spirit-filled church. That's why the, you get distracted and lost into all these things that are just an uh, abomination to God. They're demons coming up into your mind. They're affecting the very way you think. You got excuses and stories and, and, and advice for everything and everybody. But it ends as long as you stay here. As long as you stay here, I'm going to keep packing the truth in you. And you're going to start breaking down. I'm talking to you, demon. You're going to start breaking down. It's going to be less of you and more of Jesus in Kelly's life, in Ben Lynette's life. Ben Lynette says, I've been through this. I know what it's like. These things going to get mad. They may get mad, but Jesus is going to destroy him because he's already destroyed him. Keep coming out of Dana's forehead. Keep coming out of the frontal lobe in the name of Jesus. Look at me, Ben Lynette. Make them look at me. Something about demons don't like. Look, the, the first thing they'll do is identify who in the groom knows their power and authority. That's who they do not want to look at. That's why they turn away. That's why they get y'all to turn off your cameras. It's not about Nathan. The only thing I provide is I know my power and authority. You do something several thousand times and you start getting the hang of your power and authority, but it's all Jesus, 100%. And they're petrified of the Holy One. That thing of Dana's, yeah. See, it's verifying it with his facial expressions. Yeah. Come up out of Kelly. Kelly, let it go. Put your hands like this and say, Jesus, I'm yours. Say, I want you gone, enemy, in the name of Jesus. Remember, y'all, desperation gets free. Humility, meaning forget what you think. Toss it out. And desperation. Those are the beginning two stages of getting free. It's not about religious things. It's about none of that. Come on, Bimnet. I need that thing up. Is there any more down in there, Bimnet? Let's get it up. It's all about Jesus and the good things he's done. Flame wide these gates. Let's see his kingdom come.